Good evening, everybody. I just want to touch base on day three of five, and I'm going to try to do this, and hopefully the internet don't cut out on me. So, first I'm going to read Psalms 34:10. That's chapter 34, 4, verse 10. It says, "Those who speak the Lord lack no good thing." How powerful is that? This this is a very powerful verse, and it it tells you how you can be courageous. In your walk with Christ and if you walk your life with Christ it makes life easier and you can, tr you can put your trust in him and not yourself and I find it quite comf comf comforting to know that God provides every need I want and the reason why I keep on looking down I'm sorry it just I I'm reading my road down so I don't forget and hello Dan and I just want to tell you more about what he said. And I find it quite comforting to know that he provides everything I want. He even said in his word that we must give God the request and desires of a heart. And he will provide Proverbs 34, 7. So many times I feel like I am struggling and I am going aimlessly through dark a dark tunnel and with a flashlight that has low batteries and the light is very dim. And I can't. I I trust in what God's going to provide for me, but sometimes I let my pride get in the way and it it stops me at times in my own tracks because I'm struggling. I'm saying, Lord, how am I going to deal with this? And I'm trying to do it on my own, but I forget that Christ is there. Even myself, I struggle with that a lot whenever I'm struggling with a, a task at work. If there's something that's really crucial that, crucial that needs to get done and I don't know how to do it and I'm really panicking I said you know what how can I do this how can I do this and I'm searching everywhere searching everywhere and then I remember oh I gotta pray my struggling starts to lighten up and then I like I said I pause for a moment and then realize that the struggles I have don't have to deal with it on my own I have someone that is lifting me out of the shallow waters of my life and laying me on dry land so I can rest I can be correct, correct, courageous and knowing I have him to help me. With the help of the Lord, I will defeat the devil and the evil that he tries to bring to me in my life. And I don't allow it. God provides all and all is provided by God. Psalms 23, 1. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. So stand tall, stand proud, and stay in for God. For he is our strength and our salvation. Be courageous in God. I can't wait to talk to you tomorrow about the fourth day. I'm not going to say what it is because I'm not going to give the spoiler. You guys take care. God bless. Bye-bye.